Hey there, Michael Kuhlman here. Uh, it's a rainy day here in Altamont Springs, Florida. Um, thanks for clicking on the video. The clip you're about to watch is part of actually like an hour and 40 long minute video that I kind of put together um, where I reviewed a bunch of other books and authors, the uh, books off my shelf. So um, if you're interested in this clip, check out that larger video. Thank you for clicking on the video. And the final book I wanna talk about is an interesting one called Heroes Die um, by Matthew Stover. Um, fantasy book, but again with the fantasy, futuristic, um, really super well written. Um, the guy trained in martial arts and not jujitsu, but like striking and boxing and stuff. And so the fight scenes are just like hand-to-hand -hand combat and they're really, really well detailed. Like, I don't think I've read any book where there's a better just like punching moving like the description of how uh the, our main character is fighting is just excellent um you could tell the the author has experience in that uh i'm gonna give this a reread i've only read it once it's a pretty pretty beat up book but um it's i love books where you start to read you're intrigued by it and then more levels open up and that's exactly what happens here um <clears throat> really impactful scenes like every 100 pages or so there's a uh, an inter interaction with a character or uh, we we discover something new about our main character and it's fascinating. Um, I don't want to spoil it too much. Like if you read it about 150, 200 pages in, you, sh you realize that this guy is, the book opens up in a fantasy setting where he goes in and tries to kill um, in a castle and tries to kill the king of the castle or the prince or something. And then 150 pages in, we sort of realize that what he's actually what this character actually is is a, is a famous actor and he's in a simulation and people get to tune in from the future world and live behind his eyes and so what he does is try to make the most exciting thing possible um for in this fantasy world as an actor a paid actor and he's putting on a movie, a display, almost like Gladiator. But you get to be behind the eyes of the Gladiator as they're trying to move up the ranks. And then there's a woman that um, challenges him. And then he can't figure out if she's an actress or a real person within the game. And so there's multiple layers. The character, the main character <coughs> is a like a macho man uh in the game in the simulation but in real life he's different and he learns that kind of the character arc is you can't solve problems with your fists always sometimes you gotta let loose and uh solve things in different ways and that's really interesting really well crafted um you should read it so yeah okay that's it guys hey um, I'm going to do a quick video at the top, but, um, if you, I want to interact with anybody who's sat here and watched throughout all of this or clicked through and seen this to the end. If you mention to me through the comments or contact me in any way, I would love to either talk about these books or give a more detailed in-depth review. I could get, you know, give these a reread and provide that if it would be valuable to you all, because that, that's the reason I'm doing this is sort of to make that. Um, and you know, kind of run it like a business. So I appreciate if anyone's watched this and hopefully I've been interesting to you. So, um, I, I get something out of it too. I, I love just sharing this and making this and, um, I plan to do it much more. So, all right guys. Um, see ya.